I'm Josh. And I'm Kristen. And this was supposed to be the summer of Milwaukee. Yeah. The DNC convention. The Bucks on their way to winning a championship. And like always, the State Fair and Summerfest. Prior to COVID-19, over 50,000 people were planning on coming to this awesome city of Milwaukee for the Democratic Convention. And Milwaukee was planning on benefiting from that economic boom. So Milwaukee's missing out on all of you, but you folks are also missing out on Milwaukee. Hey. We want to show you some of the gems that you'd stumble upon if you were with us right now. Everybody socializes in similar ways. We love festivals, we love barbecues because that's when Milwaukee kind of comes alive. Milwaukee's culture runs deep, not just Polish, not just German, but it runs deep in, in paths of the Great Migration and really seeing like what it's like to be in a community for a long time. And the parks, man, the parks go crazy in Milwaukee. I mean, it's a green ass city, there's a lake right there. A city of grit, honest hard work. A history of industrial manufacturing, blue collar jobs that have been hollowed out. But yes, we still have all the beer. You know, people still hang on to those traditions such as like the, the beer uh, gardens that come from the German tradition. And you can still see that despite the challenges that Milwaukee faces. I love the culture of Milwaukee and Wisconsin as a whole, which has a strong working class identity. So there is this rich culture of art and protest and uh, a place to make real breakthroughs. And while there may be oppression, that's where the hard work comes and you build and you build to have breakthroughs. The reason that I stay in Milwaukee is that I feel like Milwaukee helped raise me. I think of Milwaukee personified like as a woman that like, can be very gentle with you, or if you disrespect her um, and try to parachute in, we can tell. Eventually, if I do want to raise a family, I want to raise them here. But I think there's just so much work that needs to get done. I'm so proud of Milwaukee. Milwaukee inspires me and breaks my heart at the same time. And that's why I haven't left. But I am so encouraged by the people. I think we are incredibly resilient. If there is a challenge in our community, we will figure it out. We will make a dollar out of 15 cents and not really know how we did it, but we'll do it. I like appreciate it. There is a greater sense of solidarity, for example, within the Latino community. There is that progressive history and that people were a part of that. Their families were a part of that. And so I feel like it's a place where there's tremendous opportunity. So what did we learn? Milwaukee is great. Milwaukee's imperfect. The promise of America is in cities like this. We met amazing people, went to some delicious eateries, and honestly just loved investing some more time in these communities. So show up when you can. <laughs>